Valentine's Day. It came around again. And you're still single. Or perhaps you're like me and you're finding yourself single for the first time in three years. <laughs> so at this time of the year, you're probably feeling just a little bit fragile. You know, you're wondering, is it me? Am I the problem? Am I the joke? <laughs> well, if that's the case, then it is. Do I have the treat for you? Today, we're gonna make a salad, get some goodness to counteract all the evil that's stewing in your heart. First off, lettuce. I would have made this video two weeks ago, but my country ran out of lettuce. I'll let that sink in. So first off with lettuce, you could go one of two routes. You could go the nice, beautiful way, or you could just laugh at the fact that this looks like a really disturbed vagina. Or maybe I just have a strange vagina. You don't need to wash the leaves, all right? Just let the dirt enter your soul. Let the pesticides consume you so that you end up getting closer to death. Just arrange them into a really cute flower, even though you're the only one that's gonna see it because you're alone. Add some more in the middle. Make it a mess, like your entire life. So right now you have a pretty successful looking flower. Actually, I'm quite impressed. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to go well. Next up. You're gonna need some of these bad boys. Now really, you can add as many or as few as you'd like. You can even dedicate one to each of your failed relationships. One for me, one for my ex. One for me, one for the guy who took my virginity on Good Friday and then dumped me two days later. We'll just go with two. Next up, we have cucumbers, because what kind of salad would it be without a nice big, it's too easy, isn't it? It's too easy. Once you've gone through all the little tiny ones, you finally find yourself a big one or two. Save that for later. It's time to start chopping. Now, if you're a child, don't do this at home, okay? You just, let's just put the salad to one side. And so first off, you just wanna lay your cucumber down and then chop it. Oh good, my landlord's gonna kill me. Just sprinkle the slice of cucumber all over your salad. You know, it doesn't really matter. If it's still in the plastic, keep it wrapped. That's my advice from me to you. Sure, put some little dicks on there, sure, why not? Fuck it. Next up is the vegetable that ruins everyone's day. I don't understand anyone who likes carrot. They're fucking disgusting. Now really the trick with carrots, or at least grating carrots, is you just have to do it in the same motion, at the same speed, with the same pressure, okay? That way you get nice, even grated bits. So you just wanna take your carrot, don't worry about washing it, closer to death, and then just swipe left. Oh, that was nearly my finger. Just keep swiping to the left. Just keep, keep swiping. Just every single time, just swipe. Just keep swiping left. Just like carrots would do to you every time. You think you found a good match? But <laughs> no, they swept you. There, we don't want too much carrot. Do you know what I love? When microphones stop working. I love it. Now next up, it's Valentine's Day. We're gonna need some kind of cream. <laughs> Too easy. Now you can use mayonnaise or you can use this cream that's got black dots in it, which is its probably quite unhealthy. Go get that checked. Open the lid, give it a whiff. Oh boy. Now really how much of this cream you put on is up to you, whether you like lots or a little. Hey, maybe no cream will come out and that's okay. Me, personally, <laughs> give me all the fucking cream. Just, just keep, Every fucking year we do this. Every year. And it always ends up like this. Now your carrot is absolutely swimming in cream. The last ingredient is just a little bit of seasoning. I have here just some plain ordinary table salt, but you know what they say, you are what you eat, right? And there you have it. A perfect, sorry, continue. A perfect, beautiful salad, perfect for those who are feeling, there is salt in the fucking air. I just, I'm breathing salt through my mouth. A perfect salad for all of the people who are feeling just a little bit lonely on this horribly, horribly over-celebrated, over-commercialized day. It would appear that all of that cream has congealed. <laughs> Great. You know what? I'm not actually gonna try it because I don't actually want to die on camera. This is not my legacy. I hope you enjoyed this year's Valentine's recipe. If you did, then you can click over here for some more similar recipes.
delicious.